Rainbows are an all year round popular design, so today we're going to do this fun rainbow look using the new Global Fun Stroke in the color Leanne's Lollipop. First, I'm going to start by spritzing a sponge with approximately four to five spritzes of water and then rubbing it back and forth across the one stroke to load up my rainbow. Then starting with the lighter color in the inner corner of the eye, I'll pat back toward the hairline with the sponge. I'll just flip it over to the other side, keeping the lighter color in the inner corner of the eye and then do the same thing on the other side. And next I've loaded up the same Leanne's Lollipop on a 3 4 inch flat brush and from the outer corner of the eye I'm just going to swoop down a curved line to a point making sure to match up the purples on each side. And next using some Paradise White on my sponge I'm going to load it up and pat in some stars using BAM stencil number 1039 and I'll do the same thing on the other side. This is probably one of my most used stencils that I have. Next I'll be using the Ultimate Graffiti Eye Stencil Set and that small half tone pattern just at the outer corner of the eyes on both sides. And then I'll use the larger half tone pattern on the stencil to go above the eyes on both sides. And next I'll be using the other stencil that comes in the Ultimate Graffiti Eyes stencil set and it has a little tiny cloud pattern on it. So we're going to be adding some clouds to our rainbows on both sides. And on the edge of the Graffiti Eyes stencil it has this little relief pattern of a cloud so I'll be using that at the very top just to give it some negative space. And next, with a very well loaded number five round low cornell brush, I'm just going to go throughout the design and swooping back toward the hairline, add a series of dots in all over the design. And then I'll come to the bottom and do the same thing. You can see how many of these nice dots I get out of one good load. Just make sure your white is very liquidy, almost dripping, and it'll make the best dots. Then to finish off this look, I'm going to come to the inner corner of the eye and make a series of dots swooping down toward the center of the bridge of the nose. And with a 1 4 inch angled shader, I'm using it to fill in my lips with two colors, the pink and the orange from Leanne's Lollipop. My favorite brush for making delicate small starbursts is this Royal Majestic Short Liner Brush. So I'm just going in with some Wolf White and I'm going to make a ton of starbursts all over this design to give it a fun, magical feel. And just to give it an extra touch of whimsy, I'll add in a series of a few dots on the lower lip. And then I'll finish it off with some Afterglo glitter in sunny yellow on the lips and all over the yellow portions of the design. And that's pretty much it. I hope you guys like this and you can use it. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.